incredible 2021 Lamborghini Urus. In this video, I'm gonna give you a detailed tour of the interior of the Urus and also talk about the specific options that this one comes with. So starting on the left, uh, really, of course, amazing fit and finish and just everything your hands touch or your butt touches is, you know, leather and other solid materials. Uh, this has some carbon fiber accents inside. Uh, you have your door opener here, you have your lock buttons, you have your window controls here. Uh, this car has a optional sun shades in the back, so if you, if you do the window controls for the back while the window is up, you can control the sun shades like that and then you can also put the window down if you want to. Uh, down here you have your uh, seat memory settings, your lighting controls here, and also controls for the front and rear fog lights. Then of course you have the incredible Formula One inspired steering wheel with the flat bottom and the uh, tricolor Italian flag and the Lamborghini logo. In case you didn't know, all Lamborghinis are named for bulls. Uh, the Urus is an ancient, bull that uh, lived in Italy and is related to today's cattle. That's what the Urus is. Uh, then we have different uh, views and things like that for the different displays. You can change what you see, you can configure everything, you can see you have a whole digital dashboard there. Um, cruise control is down here, turn signal and light flashers over there. You have these big paddle shifters here and that's how you put the car into gear. Uh, I love that on the steering wheel you have this lime colored trim or stitching which matches uh, the outside of the car. Moving on, I believe this is called the Tamburo, uh, this control setting here, and then uh, this is Anima which is your drive modes. Um, so coming up from here you have your parking sensors and you have excellent parking stuff. This has a 3D system as well, so if you push 3D there, then you actually get a view of your car in a spot, although it's silver and not uh, lime green, but you can see that we are in this uh, parking spot here. And this is part of that, you know, like I said, a 3D package uh, where you see the car like that. And then you have a range of specific views that you can look at there. And I, I love the shape of the Eurus. I was reading that it is inspired by the LM002, their original 4x4 that they had in the 80s. Uh, moving down, you have some switches here for uh, your hazard lights and turning the traction control off and your defoggers. Um, as you'll see, all the Lamborghini stuff is related to this uh, six-sided uh, shape. So all it's kind of repeated in all the displays and the shape of everything, including on the outside. You can kind of see it here as well. Moving down, you have your climate control. This is also uh, a digital screen, and you can, you know, this is a hill assist. This is parking. Uh, different settings. You can even turn the upper display off. Uh, and then again, more climate control down there. This is your radio volume. Then this is your uh, drive mode, Strata Street, Sport Sport, Corsa Track, Sabia Sand, Terra Off-Road or Dirt, and Neve is Snow. And it adjusts the suspension and the four-wheel drive to fit the conditions. Uh, the Urus has four-wheel drive with active torque vectoring and four-wheel steering as well. Put it in park there, pull this up to put it in reverse. You have your fighter plane start-stop button there. This puts it in manual mode. And then this is your Ego, uh, where you can control different settings specifically. So you have your suspension, your steering, So you can see smooth, medium, or sportive for the drive, the steering, and the suspension. And you can change that to really dial in the driving style that you like. 
parking brake here. Again, more carbon fiber trim, more lime green uh, stitching here. And of course you have the Lamborghini script there. Great, great sports seats with uh, lime green Lamborghini logos on there. Very, very comfortable. Even on long drives, I've gone on a couple 100, 200 mile drives in this and very, very comfortable uh, as well as being sporty when you're driving aggressively. You can see you have lots of speakers up here and again the speakers repeat that same pattern. Uh, this has the optional Bang & Olufsen sound system as well. Let's take a look in the back. Okay, so taking a look in the back of the Eurus, this has the optional dual sports seats in the back. You can also get a bench seat, more like a traditional SUV, but it's a lot more sporty when you have the four sports seats. And they are just like the front seats, just as supportive. And they also have individual controls, just like the front seats do. Uh, the problem, so to speak, is that when you get these sports seats, these seats do not fold down whereas the uh, bench seat does fold down to give you that big cargo space like a traditional SUV. So you do have four zone climate control, individual for each of the back seats back here, and you do have this large fixed center console with charging in there as well. And then you do have a pass-through that you can open up here that goes into the back and again the Lamborghini logo on the headrests okay so now let me show you the very back you can open it remotely with the key and then we do have a large space here again you saw we have the pass-through up there and then you can see that this this panel slides back and forth and you can remove that for even more space and you do have good cover uh, where when this is closed you can't see inside uh, you have your Lamborghini safety kit there and then you can raise and lower the rear end with that switch for easier loading and then up here you do have power controls to either close the trunk or close the trunk and lock it as well. So that's it. That completes the interior tour of the 2021 Lamborghini Urus. Thank you very much for watching the video. Take a moment, please subscribe to my channel and be sure to check out my other Lamborghini Urus videos.